Praxis Prepper. Hey everybody, this is Praxis. I'm here at my homestead build where things are obviously still under construction, but that doesn't stop canning from happening. My parents gave me a bunch of tomatoes a while ago and all my dreams of creating so many veggie wraps for myself never manifested, I was just so busy building. But I didn't want to lose the tomatoes, so I've decided to can them and I'm doing it over the parabolic solar cooker. And this is a great illustration of how really easy it is to can a lot of different things. Even with minimal infrastructure, you can still do it, especially with something easy like tomatoes. What I did is I just took an old Tostitos salsa jar, uh, you know, washed it out, got it all clean. I took the tomatoes, just shoved them into the jar, uh, didn't add anything else to it. The tomatoes just uh, shoved in here with their own juices and I put them into enough water to cover up the tops of the lids there. I've only had it in the sun and it's it's just partial sun at this point but the water is already starting to get warm after just a couple minutes. I'm going to let this get to a boil. I'll let it sit at a boil for about a half an hour. I'll take it away from the stove, take the jars out. The one thing I'm realizing right at this very moment is I don't have my, my canning jar uh, grabbers uh, to pull the jars out of there. I'm sure I can manufacture something with some sticks from the area. But the idea is, is canning can be pretty easy, especially if it's a food that is sort of acidic like tomatoes. You can just uh, can them and just in boiling water. That's not true with everything. Things like pumpkin squashes, things with a higher pH, you, you can't do it that way. Uh, but anything with a low pH, anything that's acidic, you can just can it in boiling water and it's really, really easy. And you, as you can see here, even without any electricity or anything, just get the pot boiling in the sun and there you go. So if you haven't tried canning, consider it. There are lots of really easy things to can that can get you going and then you realize how really easy it really is. This episode is brought to you in part by Burning Hearth Homestead, a nonprofit that aims to provide seeds, live plants, and education to the community both local and extended. Plant seeds, plant knowledge, plant the future. If you'd like to thank them for supporting this channel or find out more about what they do, go to burninghearthhomestead.org. Please subscribe and tune in every Friday at 4.30 New York time for a new video. And if you'd like to support this channel, you can do so both through Patreon or PayPal.